Recently, me and Bryson caught up with Mr. DeGay about construction. Well, certainly um, what has changed is behind the wall. And so uh, the construction phase 2B, which will be done at Christmas, is really nearing completion. And so that time over fall break, the time to where the students weren't in, weren't in session, we were able to really get a lot of things uh, accomplished in those areas. Much work still needs to occur the last four or five weeks, but I'm, but, uh, I'm, I'm certain that area 2B will be open for students when they come back from Christmas break. The buses are now picking up on the south end. That will occur for the rest of this year and all of next year. So where buses are stay the same um, for, the, for the duration. Um, other changes is, would be on the 2E side, which is the north side, where uh, first floor is the um, multipurpose weight room, uh, second floor is the wrestling gym. Uh, we're also going to have a band guard area. You see much of that work happening now out front of our high school. And we will talk as we walk around a little bit for students. Uh, you'll starting to see some of your rooms changing a bit in room numbers. And so many times you get used to where you're going. So that's really how, uh, how you see it. But, uh, you know, we're going to have three major hallways and the rooms are going to revolve around those three hallways. And so there will be a time very, very shortly that uh, we stop saying old K, old H, old V hallways, and we talk about basically A, B, and C hallway. And so uh, as we have more planning sessions, as we get together and more videos, we will really outline what those look like and, and, and where those hallways will be. And I'll give you a little bit of snippet as we walk around kind of, kind of testing those areas. So let me reiterate a little bit uh, a question that I oftentimes get asked. Will the classrooms on the other side of the wall that's being constructed now, will those be in, in use? The answer is yes. So really what ends up happening is if you're a teacher, for the most part, that's going to be in constructed areas in the 2C area that I showed, you are probably moving your classrooms into the to the constructed 2B area right now. Students, you'll have to be looking at your schedule through PowerSchool and when you get back after Christmas break, you'll have to you know, figure out if your room has changed into one of those new current areas. Spring break. So it's spring break, what will end up happening, this hallway stays open for the rest of the year of course, but at spring break we will begin to work on uh, the construction inside of the auditorium. So from the uh, stage to about these doors, they'll do some, they do the construction, sort of the tear down of the auditorium. So students will be able to walk through here no problem. April. That'll come back to us as a full hallway. You see the steel up above there? That is a, that is a connector between the gym and, and that area. So first floor down there where you're seeing the construction happening will be the weight room. Second floor up top will be the wrestling gym. And then up front there, that you're also going to see construction from there to door 16. It's going to be a band and guard area. So that'll all be done in a little bit of phases. This direction will be done about April. The rest of it's going to need some more time, but will be done by the end of this summer. As we have more planning sessions, as we get together and more videos, we will really outline what those look like and, and, and where those hallways will be. Thanks for the update. This is Drew from BHS TV.